What if I told you you can get involved as quickly as a transfer student and have some fun doing it? Like bowling. Oh my god! Play the graphic! Let's go! Hello everybody and welcome to the GCU Lobe Show. I'm your host Caleb Dewar. I am super excited as today's episode launches our brand new summer series. That is right, every episode throughout the summer is going to show you some fun things to do on and off our campus. I'm super excited for it. Today we're talking about the transfer experience, but guess what? I'm not a transfer. So what did I do? I brought in a good buddy of mine who was a transfer who had a pretty successful GCU career. Let's meet him. My name is Sam Yonan. Uh, I'm a GCU alumni. I graduated last spring of 2020. Uh, not only did I have the privilege of serving as the student body president here, uh, but I also served as a transfer student. So I'm very grateful to be here today and just talk about the story of one transfer student here. Let's talk about that story of a transfer student who also had a ton of fun here, didn't you? Of course, every step of the way. Oh yeah, and one of those ways uh, is bowling. So uh, <laughs> let's see if we can still bowl. Let's go give it a try. We're gonna go down to Thunder Alley and bowl. Timeout from bowling. Pretty close game here, honestly. What was the first memory you had of having fun at GCU? Yeah, honestly, one of the first things that I think really captivated me that I tell people I'll never forget uh, was the very first chapel I yeah. went to, uh, the very first Monday of the very first week coming here. Uh, walking into an auditorium, uh, into the arena, you know, not knowing one other person. Uh, having, it's kind of scary. It was kind of scary, but I mean, it was beautiful at the same moment. Just having thousands of students there, probably more people in that room than in my entire hometown. Wow. Um, just being there and worshiping and singing and praising. What's a small little nugget of advice that you would give a getting connected? GCU provides a lot of opportunity to do that. So you just have to take the, the initiative of yourself uh, and to take that opportunity, you know, go to your CGs go to the, the Bible studies on your floor, go to the events that you did in CAB, yeah. uh, that ASGCU does, that Spiritual Life does. That will be part of your story and being rooted in GCU. Oh yeah, or even coming down here to Thunder Alley and uh, playing bowling with somebody you don't know and making a friend. <laughs> I'm not making a friend with Sam right now because he's beating me. <laughs> Let's play some more bowling and we'll talk more transfer stuff. Well, we just wrapped up an amazing game. We don't need to talk about who won. Doesn't matter. I did, but no. <laughs> How did you go from a transfer student to student body president? It kind of all started with going to the very first orientation, which I feel like a lot of students don't want to go to, or they but don't they see should. the value. They go. should. They absolutely should, because there's a lot of value that comes out of it. So I went to the student government table there. ASGCU. ASGCU, yeah. uh, because I have background in student government from before transferring. The students there were just super engaging, super delightful. Uh, we just shared stories back and forth. And they said, they, they encouraged me to apply for the position. The position was senator. Um, so coming into that, the next fall, because I transferred in the spring, um, so coming into the following fall, I, I had the opportunity to serve as a senator. Wow. And then you were talking about with me earlier, that led to in like December of that same year, already getting asked if you're going to run or not. Yeah. For student body president. Yeah, that came out of nowhere too. And, and it's kind of funny because, yeah, in that, in that fall, around the later part of it, um, I had a few different people come up to me and, and say, you know, are you going to run? I heard you're going to run. And I was just like, I'm a transfer what, what student and about? I can't yeah. run um, because it just wasn't something that was, you know, you that you heard of. Thing. Yeah. And the rest is history. Yeah. What's some advice you would give to some transfer students that are just nervous about making that jump? If you're nervous, that is totally normal. I think I'm someone who's naturally shy, naturally <laughs> awkward. We're very different people. Yeah, exactly. But, you know, um, you have to come out of your comfort zone, um, not only for your academic success, but for your social success on campus too. Well, Sam, thanks so much for coming on the show. We appreciate what you did as a student and what you're doing as an employee and what you always will be representing GCU as an alumni. Uh, can we do a little lopes up one more time? Let's do it. All righty. One, two, three. <laughs> lopes, lopes up. up.